Hello and welcome to At Home with Mindy. I'm Mindy, I'm married to Barry, we have five adult children, but only two still live at home. There's Yuki who's 21 and Connor who is nearly 23 and they eat a lot. <laughs> but let's get on with the shop. This is from Farm Foods and there's quite a few meals here anyway we've got I don't even know how you pronounce that but it's Goodfellows takeaway pizzas and this variety that name there is only a pound of pizza and we've been greedy and we've had one each apart from Yuki because her sleeping's messed up so she was in bed so we didn't even buy her one because we didn't have plain cheese but for a pound each they were really good value we've got the 15 eggs I'm going to say a pound 99p but I'm sure it's gone up to a pound um, a loaf of bread oh by the way it's the 16th but this will be going up on the 17th. We've got a loaf of bread for 39p. The rolls that they do for 39p. We've only got the two. Um, spotted fudge. You've got to have a bit of fudge every now and again. For 220 grams, it was 79p. We've got the two packets of penguin cakes again at 59p. This week we've gone for it's chocolate cake with chocolate covering. They're a pound. Just to have a break from the orange ones. For Yuki, she's got her microwave pizzas. Two in there for a pound. And if you've seen it before, I say that if it's 3 99 or free for £10. You can mix it, the freezer stuff and cereals or from the fridges. Well this big kilo box should be three ninety nine, but we brought it with two freezer items so it's part of the free for £10. But a kilo, that's a lot of servings. And they had these Oreo Crunchy Bites I think Oreos are vegan, I'm not too sure, and because I never take my reading glasses, I couldn't read, oh it's definitely vegetarian anyway, but in the shop I just couldn't read all that, it's like, they're 49p a packet, so we've got one for Connor and one for Yuki, because they like these sort of things where they can grab it, get back out the room and away from me obviously. No one wants to be stuck talking to their mother. We've got three of the sift tomatoes for a pound. And I want to do my own pickled onions. Uh, sorry, pickled eggs. And I've read that it is really easy to do. So we've picked up some distilled white vinegar. That was 29p, I believe. Whoa, sorry, things are starting to fall. Um, another thing that we didn't see before is chicken roll in a can. You can always get it in the packets in the fridge, sort of thing, already sliced. But these were 59p, and I've heard of the brand. Old yolk, they do hot dogs. So I'm thinking it shouldn't be too bad, but that's 300 grams for 59p. So we picked up two, and we picked up a tikka masala that's a 500 gram jar for 59p. I thought I could use that just to pour a thin layer over chicken, cut it, cook it up, then cut it and but we'd have the sort of chicken tikka that you 
get in the fridges at Tesco's and that sort of I'm sure you know what I mean, the little chopped up bits. Um, we've got 10 square sausages. They make a nice change from having burgers. A block of butter for 99p. And we finally got round to trying these from the last light I bought. They're skinless pork sausages. They're really nice. Normally the end bits where the skin's been twisted, that can go quite hard, but because there's no skin, it was nice all the way through. We've got the two Emerge Energy Drinks, they're two for a pound, and we've picked up two sugars, one pound ten if you buy two. We've only picked up one because um, even though it's only a pound, it's beer batter flavour, and I'm just not sure about putting beer in batter, whether you're going to better taste it. So we've only got one box of Conant Barry to try. These, I thought they were going to be a bit like a chicken nugget. They're an actual whole kilo for one ninety nine, But when you read, it says flaming chicken chunks. It says something about paprika being in it, but I don't know if they're going to be hot or not. But these are frozen, breaded, and they're put, they're breast chunks, but it says that they're already cooked, so you literally are just going to have to reheat them. See there, 100% whole fillet, but for one ninety nine for fillet meat, I thought that was quite good. Then we've got the eight chicken burgers for 99p. They're nice and the breadcrumb coating is really thin. So you get a decent amount of chicken in that. We've only picked up one milk at 89p. We brought these last time barbecue ones and I said I thought they were a bit like the bird's eye char grill steaks because they got the lines but when you open them they, the lines that serving suggestion it does say that it turns out they're pure mini fillets but with flavouring on them so it's not a convenience food a, it's not a processed food as such it's literally a nice chunk of chicken with a flavouring on it We've had the hot and spicy wings before, so we thought we'd try the sticky barbecue. Oh, sorry, these were one ninety nine. These are three ninety nine. So that went with the frosties and the other item in that price range was the eight pork loin steaks. You get a kilo. And last time I actually had 10 in, so we had two each, me, Barry and Connor, and the spare four he took over to his parents so that they could try them, try and talk them into using farm foods as well then. <laughs> but I don't know if they've tried them yet, but they are, that's pure meat again. And I finally used up my last bag of these chicken mini fillets you get two and a half kilos which is roughly five pound in weight but it's 6.99 so that's about one pound 20 per pound i think it's late at night so if my maths is wrong we'll blame that and we've changed the brand of chips because they're still like french fries, they're still the skinny ones but this one, 79p again but just because it doesn't say American fries you get 2 kilos so you're getting an extra 750 grams for the same weight and then obviously again I don't think we'll ever go to farm foods without buying 2 
toffee cheesecakes at a pound. And then Hubby, if you've seen my last farm food one, he brought four crates of Dr Pepper. He's only halfway through his first crate, but he wants a change. So he's actually picked up two of the 24 packs of proper Coca-Cola. It's 10 99 a tray, or two trays for £20. So a bit more expensive than the other offer. But he earns some money, so I can't stop him from buying himself a little treat. You can't have his coke, he might refuse to work. Then what will I do? Right, and then the last item is we've been buying the Doritos in a box of 12 because it's two for a pound, so the 12 box only costs six pound and it's in cool original because they still do have some Doritos left so it'll give them a variety now but that was what we got and I've just got to find you the receipt right. hopefully the light's good before the voucher the e-voucher thing that they send you it would have come to £70 and 83p but they take five pound off when you spend 50 so it was 65 pound and 83p which considering 20 pound of that was coke i don't think it was too bad because there is a lot of pure meats this time and a few different things that we haven't tried before so I'm going to say that's not actually too bad for the shopping and if you see the video that I put up before this one there's my veg because I didn't get it in farm foods we got it in Morrison's because you have to go past Morrison's to get to farm foods so we've done both shops in one day so hopefully that's not breaking rules because they say shop once a week but I don't think they've actually said you've only got to do one shop. I think you can pop into two shops in one day. We'll find out when I get told off. But hopefully I haven't done anything wrong. But that's my shopping this time. And I think we might try, if I don't get in trouble, I think we might try popping into Morrison's again on the way back. Because I did have fun in there. So, um, yeah, I'm going to stop talking now because I'm rabbiting, so bye-de-bye.